Hi, today's video is gonna be yet another experimental one. This time I'm exploring the flat brush painting technique and style. I've seen a lot of great inspiring artists who are really amazing at it and I've always wanted to try it, so here I am. So these sketches are like my learning point of this style. It was my first time trying it out and I recorded them for you guys. And I think I did an okay job, it being my first time. I got a lot to refine and I'm sure with more practice it could be done. I did multiple studies of eyes and the last one is half of a portrait and I could see myself slightly improving at it as I kept painting. The first thing that attracted me in this style is the texture and the brush strokes that were clearly visible. It had that incomplete and messy vibe to it and I'm a fan of both those vibes when it comes to art. My sketches are usually super messy and rough so I took a liking to it almost immediately. I used limited colors only about 5 to 7. It being Prussian blue, crimson, scarlet, portrait pink, light blue and white. These are the main colors that I used and I used acrylic paints for this. I limited myself from using more and a wide range of colors so that I could use the warm colors advance and cool colors receive concept. As you know, it's an illusion created by our eyes as they adjust when both warm and cool colors are placed next to each other. The warm colors have longer wavelengths than the cool colors which makes it seem like the warm colors are advancing and the cool colors are receding, which helps us to use them in place of highlights and shadows respectively. I was careful while I was painting. 
I took my time to study the reference image and check for the places that are bright, brighter and brightest and the parts that are dark, darker and darkest. This exercise really helps you to view highlight, shadow and midtones of both in any given reference image, be it a black and white or a color image and you alter that according to the colors that you're gonna use. It's a great exercise to train your eyes to see them as highlights, shadows and as midtones. At one point I was skeptical about which color to use for the iris of the eyes and I tried using different colors as I kept doing different paintings and I think my favorite is the third eye. I think it looks the best out of the rest. And let me know in the comments which one you like. So thank you so much for watching this video. I'm going through a phase where I'm being constantly inspired by other artists' styles and techniques and I'm just trying my hand at them and blending my signature style into it as well. I've also tried this same technique digitally and I've also tried my hand at the single line drawing. So if you want to see either of those, head on over to my Instagram and if you want to see either of those on YouTube, give this video a like and let me know in the comments below and I would love to do it. Let me know if you guys want a step by step tutorial of this technique. Check out my Instagram to see more of my previous and my future experiments. I've given all the links in the description below to like, comment, share and subscribe. Keep creating and I'll see you soon. Bye!